Hey everybody, welcome back to Cajun Living. I'm Cody. I'm Christina. And today we're just giving y'all an update on everything. It's been hot out here. So we about getting ready to start our fall gardens. And we're looking at some seeds from Hoss. We got some romaine lettuce, some Chinese cabbage, beets, spinach, turn, uh, broccoli. Broccoli. I can't wait to try this one, that butternut. Carrots, onions, cabbage. Sweet peas. We got some basil growing here on the porch in our blackberry pots. Got a deer in the field here. Never seen one come this far into the field. Standing in an ant pile. God bless America. Nice. Oh. Look like it got a hurt leg. Poor thing. Yeah, it's limping. It's got a hurt leg. Alright guys, let's get back to our update. That was some cool action right there. We don't see that too often. No. Too many outlaws here in Louisiana. Anyway, so our garden about finished. We'll show y'all the freezer here in a minute. Our purple hall peas did magnificent. We got our squash, zucchini, our butter beans. They're uh pretty loaded. Let's check that out. Butter beans in here. And our meat birds. Now here's the story with them. We had them over there and didn't realize we had them on that down slope. And a raccoon got in there and killed every bit of them but three. Well, two of them three ended up dying look they just enjoying the ants so out of that first batch that y'all might have seen we only got one left a rooster so the wife went to tractor supply and picked up some more and they're what about four weeks old oh no they're probably about a month old now Four weeks old? Yeah. About a month. And we got us a little turkey and another goose because the next day after we lost like 14 meat birds, the next day we ended up losing one of our geese. So we only got one goose left. And how many chickens was it that day? Another three. We lost Rocky. One of, Rocky, one of the uh, Americanas. And the black one. Black and one of the uh, Astrolarchs, yep. yep. So let's go look at that freezer, all we harvested this year. So guys, here's the freezer. We got purple hall peas out the yin-yang. We got more purple hall peas. We got a little picking of some butter beans. More purple hall peas. This is all green beans. Turnips from the past winter. 
We got some squash, squash. Zucchini. Yep. Bell pepper that we grew. All corn. We have more corn and more squash, but we've been eating oh, that. Oh, and okra. Yep, the okra, I don't know. Big old beautiful plants, but man, they're not putting out too much. We're going to have to figure out what's wrong with that. And here's the leftover deer that I had killed this past season. So. Two of them. Yep, so it gave a lot away. But this whole freezer is just for what we can grow, raise, and kill. So we're back out here at the garden, guys. And like I said, them okra plants are just phenomenal. But they're not making too much okra. And I did hear that shouldn't fertilize okra. So maybe that's what it is. So maybe that's what it is. I don't know, y'all. Leave a comment down below if y'all have any ideas let us know but look how huge some of these stalks are just huge and yep. we planted some uh, peaches and cream corn the bugs were tearing it up pretty good we put some diastomaceous earth on it and the wife been getting a lot of bell peppers they're starting to slow down turn yellow Our tomatoes didn't do too great this year. And the chickens, we let them out a couple times and they ate a couple. Or more than a couple. Got one tomato blushing right there, getting ready to be picked. I can yeah, pick that one. Go ahead and grab Put that it. in the window seal. So that's it, bon. And our banana peppers there, them suckers are loaded. And we got our egg layers here. We just heard Big Red start crowing this morning. Not loud, kind of faint, but yeah. And we got Fonzo over there, the gray Polish. And that gold Polish, that thing can't hardly see where he's at. And we got Doug right there eating the turkey. And my wife's goose. Uh, what's his name, babe? Stuart. Stuart. Hey, Stuart. Stuart. Hey. 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 <laughs> He'll talk to you, man. We've been doing that ever since he was young, and he always talks back with us. Hey. Stuart. Hey. Hey, buddy. When the meat birds are done... We're going to move these chickens out of here because i got to do some dirt work. The water's going on the cement slab. And y'all probably saw the front of the house. We've been remodeling, so the back, we need to get that done. we got to do some dirt work here to get the water flowing a little better. We had some watermelons back here, but we had a pretty good idea that they were going to get eaten with the... Uh, the coons were going to eat them. But one night I came out here, I took out about three coon, one possum, one armadillo. This is what we were calling the bonus garden. But the coons got our watermelons. Oh, they grew. Yeah, they're growing. Yeah, it's taking over. I got, I got to keep this clear because there's a high line here. And I don't want them coming in my yard last time they came they rutted up our yard and plus we got a garden there got the chickens fenced in here so i'm sure y'all remember the goats we uh got rid of them kind of regret it. it is what it is but when we get one that's gonna let us milk her then we'll get them back yeah we'll get a male and female next time that way we can milk them and they'll mate. And mate them. But I do miss them. Yeah. That's so, for sure. Yeah. So I'm about to start cutting this grass. It's about knee high. So I hope y'all enjoyed the video. And like, share, subscribe. And hope to see y'all again. Thanks, guys.
Stuart. Hey. Hey. Hey, buddy. Stuart. Hey. Hey.